By 2030, we could grow meat cheaper than we can kill for it. This is the Freedom Headlines report where we just touch briefly on some, 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 well, in this case, these are hopeful headlines. And this is a hopeful headline for me. Cultivated meat projected to be cheaper than conventional beef by 2030. Now, I am not saying that I actually believe this headline uh, because there's a lot of hype out there. And this, this looks like it might be a bit of a hype. But whether it's 2030, maybe it's not 2030, maybe it's 2040, maybe it's 2050. But either way, it is true that they are bringing down the cost of manufacturing meat of being able to grow meat now the, the caveat being with this cultivated meat project like any other technology out there the, the the question is who controls the technology and if it's and if it's locked behind an internet or uh, an intellectual property firewall well you can bet that uh the benefit to we the poors will be not very great and they will not be interested in we the poors developing small scale ability to grow our own meats but that's what we the poor should be working on, whether we do it through black markets, gray markets, or whatever it might be. That's the answer. Whenever you see these technology stories, and I'm going to repeat this all the time, cultivated meat projects projected to, uh, this is, now this is a Reddit link, so let's go to the Reddit link, and then we'll click on to the actual story here from Reason. Oh, well, that's fitting. Reason, they're kind of, uh, they're like... And cap kind of vibe, libertarian kind of vibe. Uh, that's that's not entirely with them, but that's that's more the, the vibe that they're coming from. I'm not an and cap or libertarian. I'm an unaffiliated. I'm a, I'm a practical practical tarian. I'm a reality of powerist. I'm a freedomist in the truest sense. Freedomist is uh, well w the way we define freedomist. Freedomist is uh, this is we are we are Christians that operate in the civic and we seek seek to do it in as biblical way as possible. So not not quite aligned with these guys, but still I can see why they'd be interested in this story, but let's see if they talk about I'm just glancing through here. I'm not going to read all this and you can and, and it doesn't look really like they've really touched on what I talked about, the intellectual property issue. It really is about if the pro if the technology that they're talking about, in this case, San Francisco-based company Just Eat Grows Cultivated Chicken Nuggets in Vats from Real Chicken Muscle and Fat Cells. Okay, and you can buy them at res restaurants, Singapore, whatever. So they don't really touch on the IP issue, and that's a shame because uh, that's that's the more important story. But if we could cultivate meat, if we could grow meat rather than, than growing and killing animals, I'm all for that. Although I'm still going to eat animals, but I'm... Even for me, I'm trying to find some farms, local farms, built, buying from local farms instead of from 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 grocery stores, from large scale systems. I want to buy from small scale systems as much as possible. And I'll just go through the, the other headlines on here. You go to freedomist.com and read these stories in, in, in depth. We have uh, new material breakthrough could be the key to revolutionary transparent electronics from SciTechDaily.com. Self-learning, self-evolving smart quantum technologies for secure communications. This is from Louis, from SciTechDaily.com. Louisiana State University researchers have introduced a small quantum technology for the spatial mode correction of single photons. Well, you read it and get it's a breakthrough. It'll help. It'll help. It'll help. But again, always the question is, we need to have open source versions that we the poors can can utilize and develop on our own, develop our small-scale systems. And then you can see the rest of the stories. I'm not going to read all the headlines here. I'm just going to read a couple of them. There you go. There you go. So grow your meat. 